right here is a picture of an app you can download on Apple or Android called FBI Child ID app. You can keep current information of your children on it just in case the unthinkable happened and you couldn't find them. Today on Undetected Footprints, we are talking about Kara Penn. She's been missing since January 24th of 2022. She was last seen in Henderson, Nevada, and was 15 years old at the time of her disappearance. Kara's dad, Bobby Penn, dropped his daughter off at school, but when he returned to pick her up, she never showed up. Kara has been missing ever since. She is one of the more than 40 children still missing in Nevada. Her father hopes she's in a safe place. Her father said it started with a divorce. Him and his ex-wife had a contentious divorce. And he feels like Kara and her brother got caught in the middle. It accumulated in Kara's mother losing custody, he said. When Kara and her brother moved in with Penn, he thought the family had finally found a new normal. Penn and Kara was a diligent student in school and an avid gymnast. But on January 24th of 2022, Kara left school during the day and hasn't been seen since. It's been difficult dealing with that, Penn said. I just hope she's in a safe place. As of right now, it's just frustrating. Over the past couple of years, Penn said the flow of information coming in from police has slowed. He said that police have exhausted a series of leads. A subpoena phone record shows Kara was communicating with a number that Penn said belonged to his ex-wife's boyfriend on the day of her disappearance. But after that, Kara went completely off the grid. He said police have searched his ex-wife's house, but Kara was not there. He's worried about his daughter's quality of life. Is she going to school, he wondered. It's kind of like she's living on the run, but what kind of life is that? They are unimaginable circumstances, he said. They won't and rightfully so desire a return of their children as quickly as possible. And sometimes that doesn't happen. While he believes this issue is something most parents don't even want to think about, he said preparation is critical. When Kara moved in with Penn, he said that he didn't have a conversation with her about everything that was going on. All I ever wanted for her was just to be a kid, he said, but he regrets not having this difficult talk. He urged parents to stay involved in their kids' lives. Don't put it off, just do it now. Adding that even if she hadn't wanted to speak to him, at least she would have heard it. And maybe she would not have run away. Kira is now 17 years old. Penn hopes that one day, perhaps once she returns 18, she will reconnect with her father and brother. She has a lot of good that she could do in this world, says her father. School one day and never came back. Don't know if she's a runaway, if her mother has her, if a stranger has her. He just doesn't know. Hopefully one day he can find out what happened to Kira and where she is. And hopefully she can be safely found and her father can see her.